Roblox UGC makes me want to jump out of my window and land head first and dive into a super volcano. Sometimes, some hats are cool and some are garbled duty. But I gotta give credit where it's due though. UGC has been my main source of income somehow even though my hats are very irrelevant. You, you, you should buy them guys, they're kinda cool. Anyway, now let's look at the garbo. One of my least favorite types is definitely the text ones. Made in Ohio. <laughs> Get it guys? Ohio? That funny weird place that I can't even find on a map. Remember when Ohio was actually kind of funny and then it was spammed to death on TikTok and now whenever literally anything slightly out of the realm of average happens, every middle schooler is going bros from Ohio skull emoji, crying emoji, and might as well slap that fucking NPC emoji, you degenerate. I wonder how Jake Paul feels about this. But I'm from Ohio, the white That's not the only one by the way. We also got Olin Ohio from Ohio, Ohio Energy. Okay, even if you s somehow still find calling everything Ohio funny, even though you have no idea where it is, why is text above your head a Roblox hat? This is an accessory meant to be worn. Why the fuck are you carrying letters above your head? I will tell you right now, if you buy any of these, you will wear it for one day, maybe two, and then never again. This is going on nobody's main outfit, because I've never seen anyone wearing any of these ever. And not just the Ohio ones, we also got the what was he cooking, and what was she cooking, does he know? You know, I actually used to unironically watch new rock stars, and now that his thumbnails became memes and they're used as reaction images, this is kinda painful and also hilarious to watch. Same thing with the clickbait error thing. Again, I kinda get why some people might find it funny, but this is your Roblox outfit. You will never be wearing this for more than one day, probably. Now let's look at something different. You go to the outer shop and you look up red bandana and you find this, a nice little accessory called red bandana. And how much do you think it costs? 50 robux, a reasonable price. And then you look a little further and you find another red bandana and this one costs 75 million robux. What the fuck? Okay, well, while if some kid who has a red themed outfit and wants to include a red bandana, I don't think that his only choice would have to cost him 75 million robux which is like $250,000, which would probably be three times his entire family's annual salary. This hat now pretty much makes the for some reason 75 million Robux red bandana obsolete. Good. So all of the owners of it, have fun. The next absolute horse poop hats that are under UGC catalog are the meme trend ones. Well, they're still better than the text ones because at least these actually try. Extremely sus hole in the floor. Okay, this is obviously from Among Us, but if you really think about it, what on earth is this? Who the fuck is going to wear this? Chad meme head. Bro, this looks disturbing. This is what happens when you take a 2D drawing and recreate it in 3D while maintaining the art style. Kid named Finger. This looks even more disturbing. Mike deserves justice. Chemistry teacher, which is a very hideous version of Walter White. Look, I don't even know if these are meant to look terrible, but this is the perfect example of why Roblox should not go for photorealistic faces. This does not work for Roblox. Here's a normal Walter White outfit that I made. Here's the one that uses the abomination of a head. This should be illegal. Flabbergasted, which is supposed to be from that stupid ass reaction image. I don't even know what the context behind this image is. But you know what? I don't even want to know. And there's a whole lot more. And as you can tell, they're all made by completely different people. It's not just one Neanderthal making these goofy ass hats. It's a whole army of these NPC UGC creators. And despite how long it's been, the people in the comment section have not evolved at all. It's always been like this. All these little goofballs are still at it. If you are reading this, then you will die in your sleep tonight. If you copy this in another comment section, you will have good luck forever. Fatherless child under me. You know what? Even if this comment is right, I will refuse to post this on another comment section. Take me out of this world, please. And what is this? Mr. Bit. This is a real image in the form of a Rolex hat. This looks like something you'd see in 45 Fastbear Game Trunks Place 45. Like, what the fuck is this? W Gold Red Chain. Wear this if you want to be the average Gen Z NPC. Speaking of Gen Z, what in the world did you guys do to our everything? Why the fuck is Skull Emoji being used for laughter? <laughs> Who came up with this? Okay, I get it. I'm dying. Haha. AKA I'm dead. AKA I'm a skeleton. But not dead to the point where I've been buried for so long that all my skin has disintegrated and all that remains is my skeleton. The same way that we make fun of the older generation for using the joy emoji, our dumbass kids will make fun of us for using the skull emoji. And who knows what they will be using? The fucking coffin emoji?